Hello and welcome to another McFarland Easy Multiverse review. I can see how I the, the plastic this box for the recycling bin. And today we take a look at Captain Boomerang. So, uh, I just filmed two videos of these supposed collector's edition. And, and they were sad excuses, pathetic attempts of collector's edition. But today we have a figure that is a good reason to have something called a collector's edition. So in terms of accessories we have the stupid card stand and the stupid card. But you can read the back if you want to. And we have a stand with a silver DC that's printed off center. That's just, that's just funny. Uh, in terms of accessories, apart from the fists already on the figure, we have two boomerang holding hands, two spray open hands, and of course two silver boomerangs. So that's already way more accessories than the other two that I just shot the video for, which is Red Hood, the actual Red Hood, not Jason Todd, and Ragman. They have nothing in their boxes. And then finally, when we take a look at the figure itself, look at that. He has a uh, actual staff that, that, that's pretty cool. There's no wire in it, but it's very easy to add a wire to it. Fake leather jacket, which, you know, if you want to, you could... Yeah. Undress him, take off the scarf, and now he's an alternate look for the figure. That's that's good. That's what we expect from Collector's Edition. Now, if you take a look closer look at this figure, the head is decent. I, I saw some people online, they said that they didn't like this face in particular. And uh, I think it's okay. Um, I've only seen Captain Boomerang in like TV and movies and stuff, so I, I'm not too familiar with how he looks and cartoons, so I'm gonna base my judgment on that. So I, I think he looks fine. Ooh, that's a lot of copyright stuff on that. I wasn't expecting to see that. Uh, the colors on the body is pretty decent. They molded different color plastic. So you got black, dark blue, light blue, and skin color. So that's decent. They did paint the boomerang, tiny boomerang silver, um, which is kind of funny because he's got the small ones there, but the actual ones he holds are quite big. And there are missing paint details on like this pouch, these belts, these buckles, etc., etc. But when you have the jacket on, you don't really notice it too much. But yeah, once you put this jacket back on him, you don't really notice those unpainted bits. I'm gonna give him his scarf too. Now this jacket looks like it's wired and it's thick enough to feel like it's wired, but it's not. Um, which is unfortunate. I'm feeling like, I mean, am I able to easily add a wire to this? I want to. Maybe I can just slot one in one of these stitch spaces. So, almost there. Still, very nice jacket on a decent looking figure. Articulation wise, his head can go forward back, rotation, leaning, leaning. Uh, torso goes quite far back, quite far forward. Since this belt's not attached to anything, to the lower body, he can move quite well. Leg goes up, knee rotation, little bit, let's say about 20 degrees. Knee, boot, toe. Mm, there's a cut, natural cut in design there. They could have had a cut there, I suppose. Uh, arm goes up. Has a lot of movement on the shoulder. That's good, the butterfly joint there. I guess you could, since you're, he's wearing the jacket, you could remove that extra piece to make him move even more. Um, double elbow joint, and because the jacket hides it all, so that's nice. It does get in the way of movement a little bit though, but that's the nature of these small jacket things. So this is good. If you like the Flash and the Flash's World Gallery, this is a very good figure to pick up. Or if you just like the Suicide Squad, this is also a very good figure to pick up. Um, more of this, please, McFarlane. More hands, more like soft goods to complement the plastic bits. I'm very happy with this purchase, and I wish all the other collector's editions with the extra price uh, versus the regular figures should be at least this minimum standard, at least this. Subscribe to Jason Comment below and take care and have a nice day. I'll see you guys soon. Bye bye now.